Thank you, Madam President. Um, I also stand in support of this amendment. Um, it was a pleasure to work with the uh, chair on this um, and the housing committee. Uh, you know, th this amendment does a little bit more um, than make some technical changes. Um, I think it does a lot more. Um, there was in the original bill uh, a five dollar fee for um, the avenue to fund these positions to help facilitate some of these grants and it came in the form of a fee for permits which as I, I say often um, you know it's very expensive to do business here in Connecticut and uh, any additional fees just uh, would not be a good idea um, so with the um, cooperation and work of the good chair we were able to get rid of some fees um, and clarify some of the uh, changes that will benefit not only um, tenants but landlords and the general public um, again getting her the five dollar fee was was really big um, we're using federal money uh, which again at this time uh, any assistance was greatly appreciated again not only for tenants but the landlords um, and, and how it helps the tenants is it allows the landlords to retrofit the properties with energy efficient units such as heating and air conditioning um, and it allows uh, for a reduced cost for the utilities um, and how it helps the, the the landlords is it allows them to upgrade some of these properties and utilize some of the energy efficiency or ener energy efficient uh, equipment out there, which sometimes can be rather expensive. Um, and and uh, again, with this pandemic and the issues with the rent and uh, eviction and all of those things, right now, um, this grant in the form of some assistance to the landlords to make some of these necessary upgrades, uh, again, is just a great idea. And I look forward to implementing this um, and seeing it through uh, and how much it will benefit, again, not only the tenants and the landlords, but also the general public. Some of the tenants that are uh, going to benefit from this uh, amendment or amended bill um, are on energy assistant programs. Um, and if we're able to reduce some of those costs, it could essentially be a reduction uh, for the general public in, in the form of hopefully some type of a tax uh, decrease. Um, for, for those reasons, I do stand in support of this amendment, uh, and thank you for allowing me to speak on that. Thank you, Senator Ciccarella.